Hi right, everyone, Dave here. I hope you're okay. Perfect midsummer's evening here. Just walking down the canal. Gorgeous evening. I've been away for a while, which is why I've not been posting any content. Uh, been finding it tough recently. Uh, I mean, don't under, underestimate, I'm sure none of you do, the strength of character, the psychological, emotional strength that it takes to continue to navigate uh, through these testing, turbulent, you know, traumatic times. Um, I'm sure none of you are underestimating that, and we're, I think we're all having spells where we're feeling strong and spells where we're not feeling strong. But the point is, no matter how many times many of us fall down, we always get back up again. And that right there is strength. Getting punched down to the canvas and getting back up again. And I know that's what I do, uh, but I just wanted to be honest with you with regard to why I've not posted recently. I've been feeling devoid of ideas, not been feeling particularly creative, uh, not been feeling particularly energetic. So, but... I just wanted to do this quick video. First of all, I hope you're all okay. I hope you've had a nice weekend, whatever you've been doing. And uh, secondly, just a very quick update about the book, which I've been talking about for a long time now. It is very, very, very close to publication. I've had the, the editing's all complete, all three stages of it. I've now had the design proofs through, uh, which incorporates the obviously the front and the back cover as well as well as the actual design proof of how the books, the interior of the book's gonna look. So that's the next stage. So I've submitted changes um, <clears throat> to the cover uh, and to a little bit of the, some of the design elements in the interior of the book as well. Uh, so what I'm saying is hopefully within the next couple of weeks now, the book's gonna be published. So it's very, very close. I have read it uh, a few times actually in the last couple of weeks, the book. And you know, it's, it's, it's not something that's been easy to do, writing that book. It's something that I've had to do. It's something that I've known for quite a long time that I was going to write a book, a kind of a zeitgeist book, state of the nation book, state of society book. Um, I've always known deep down, I've got that book in me and it's a bit of a it's a bit of a weight off my shoulders now that it's virtually complete and when it's published it really um it really will feel like a burden's been lifted and i don't mean to say a burden as in <clears throat> i've not taken anything from writing the book because the reason i've written the book wasn't for me i did it because i felt like the world needed this book um and i would never have forgiven myself for not for not writing the book um what i've tried to do with it is to provide Rather than rather probably than depth um, of ideas, I've tried to provide clarity of ideas and clarity, um, give the reader clarity as to why the world is as it is at the moment, why things are so difficult, why so many people are so unhappy, to provide real definitive clarity, to explain things. To shine a light and it is very very savagely cutting parts of it because you know to, to describe this west modern western 21st century society that we have at the moment with all of its decadence and ignorance and naivety and cowardice materialism consumerism all the rest of it i, I think it'd be disingenuous to not be savagely <clears throat> to you know to, to be savagely cutting with it because somebody somebody somewhere needs to spell out the scale of the problem that we've got and try and explain it as i say in simple terms so that's what i've tried to do the second element of the book of course is to provide a solution which is where the optimism and the inspiration i hope comes in so it's called The Imperfect Individual, same as this uh, YouTube channel. Why our world is in turmoil and how you can save it. You as in the individual. So two big themes there. I have to explain why our world is in turmoil. Explain that. And there's a whole multitude of reasons. And then how, in my opinion, it is only individuals acting truly as individuals that are going to bring us back from the precipice. So anyway, 
I think what my book is going to do is going to be able to ha have the impact that I feel I've not really had recently when I've when I've been doing these videos. Um, because as I say, when I've read, I've read it cover to cover a couple of times, and I'm happy with it. It's been a massive undertaking. It's been draining. It's been difficult. The subject matter is so heavy. It's unbelievable, uh, and it will be you know detested by some people but i don't care i really don't care as long as it provides value as long as it helps the people that i know i'm trying to help and if it shocks some others into action then great so there we go so that's the update about the book i am hoping um you know it, it, it's it's life isn't it you go through cycles where you're feeling okay you're feeling energized feeling creative you're feeling enlightened you're feeling inspirational and other times where you're just not so the good news the book's out very very soon and we'll keep you up to date with that um other than that i will create a video around a piece of content when i feel i've got something to say that's gonna help so once again hope you're all good um keep a check on the channel and on the telegraph Gram, telegram channel as well because it will be providing more updates and yeah that's about it really so hope you're all good and i'll speak to you soon all right bye bye